Knowing what shots to avoid is just as important as knowing the shots you should hit when playing singles. I want you to watch this point. It's a really short point, but notice all of a sudden the returner is completely out of position. I'm going to show you why this happened. There's a really simple way to diagnose this. In singles, when you hit down the line, you must hurt your opponent. Because if you do not, you are in major trouble. We had Marin Cilic serving. The returner was way back behind the baseline. You get a good serve, and then here was the mistake. It happened right off the return. A weak down the line shot. When you hit down the line in singles, you are out of position for your opponent's next shot if you do not hurt them. He arced this ball. There's a lot of loft and like shape to that ball, which means Marin is not going to be in any trouble. He went over. The returner was so far back, it's going to take quite a while for him to get over here to bisect the next two shots, right and left, that Marin can hit. He didn't get over in time, and Marin just blasted that cross court ball. Watch it again. If you hit down the line, in singles, you better hurt your opponent with your shot. Drive the ball, hit it with depth, hit it with speed and, and the intent of hurting them. If you hit down the line like you're about to watch again and you just arc the ball, the chances of winning the point go way down. Now, if you're looking for amazing strategies that are going to help you win more singles matches, then I invite you to check out the new rules of singles. It's a brand new online solution from Will Hamilton over at Fuzzy Yellow Balls. And he's teamed up with Craig O'Shaughnessy, the leading stats guy in the world for what is working on the pro tours, both men and women's single strategies, and what you can copy from them in order to win more matches. Here, he's actually explaining the number one approach shot to hit. It works on the Pro Tour and it works in recreational tennis to lower the chances that you get passed, beaten with a lob, down the line, cross court, and to get easy volleys to help you set up winning the point. To check out the new rules of singles, you can do it one of two ways. First, you can just grab the Fuzzy Yellow Balls app in the App Store, or you can use my link. It's in the description. I'm also going to pin it in the first comment. And if you're looking for people in your local area to play matches against or practice with, maybe you want to find a local league at your level, or you want to find a coach who's close to you who can help you with your game, then use my link for Play Your Court, and it's playyourcourt.com slash two minute tennis. When you use my link to sign up, you get 50% off. If you're not sure if you can hurt your opponent, just hit the ball cross court. If this is you, and you hit the ball down the line, and you don't really hurt your opponent, your opponent can quick get over there and hit a cross court ball that completely exposes how you're out of position. Cross court is a safe play in singles. Down the line, you better hurt your opponent. And if you're playing someone who hits a weak ball down the line, then quickly get over there and hit the ball cross court into the open court. You understand the difference in when to hit down the line versus cross court in singles, there's no doubt. You're going to gain confidence, win more matches, and play much better tennis. This is Ryan Reedy from 2MinuteTennis.net. You got this.